It seemed like a normal invitation from the friends she chatted with online. But for 24-year-old Cynthia Osokugo, the invite would lead to a terrifying fate. Osokugo was lured to this hotel in Festec area of Lagos, where she was drugged, raped, and killed. Students Nwabufo Kumo and Chidera Ezike have already confessed. They say they tricked their victim to rob and rape her. But they say her death was an accident. Prosecutors, though, are busy building the charge sheet. So far, they're facing 11 separate counts. And we've added more counts, like receiving stolen property, property of uh, Cynthia that were stolen, and also that if you invite somebody illegally from anywhere, whether within Nigeria or outside Nigeria, you will be equally charged for that fraudulent invitation with intent to commit felony. Prosecutors are also pursuing the pharmacists who supply the drugs, a taxi driver, and those involved in selling Cynthia's phone. Okumo and Ezike are being detained in prison pending the trial. The judge has ordered prison officials to make them available in court on Friday. That's when the hearing of the case continues. It also is the same day Cynthia will be buried in a private ceremony in her hometown in Delta State. Adoria Chumba, Lagos, Nigeria.